I thought Jake threw a really good ball game, obviously. Um, you know, once he got a guy on, um, where he was with his pitch count and everything, we had our we have our horses in the seventh, eighth, and ninth, and we went ahead and you know uh, went to Neil right there and it, it got away, you know, and then the rest of the game started getting away uh, there in the eighth, obviously. Um, and we just have to play better baseball. That's probably, as, as the guys have seen us all year long, that's probably not. That's probably the worst game we've played all year, and um, but these men know that you know there's there are a lot of things that we have to to do, but certainly uh, staying in a big league ball game is is one of those things that requires a lot of uh, uh, commitment in terms of uh, bearing down, you know, really uh, continuing to play the game, um, you know, being aware of the the whole circumstance, everything that's going around, so. I think today it really did get away on a lot of different levels and, and a lot of different places. But uh, it wasn't necessarily for lack of effort, but I think it is uh, something where we have to regroup, uh, totally regroup, and get our mind back around just playing the game a certain way. And I think that's something that as young men uh, today, I think they're they're learning a lesson. You know, it's been a tough five-game stretch. We've lost five games in a row today. We lost a lost one that really got ugly. And uh, I think that it's a great lesson in that uh, they, I think they're all getting and understand at the major league level. It's uh, it's tough to win a ball game, and when things get chaotic, that's when you really have to come back and put yourself in, in the middle and, and try to do some, uh, some do some things that uh, put you back on track. Particularly with a, a club that's suddenly as young as this one is, that was kind of a message that you wanted to deliver to them after this game. Well, I, I think uh, it's a, it's a. I think it's a message that we've been talking about since the beginning of spring, but today I think the game itself lent it, it lent to, you know, just reiterating, reemphasizing the same things that we've talked about all year. We have to play nine innings of baseball. We really have to focus. You want to stay loose. You want to stay relaxed. I don't want you guys to get uptight. We want you to stay nice and loose, uh, but we do have to direct our energies and our focus in the game. And uh, you know, I don't want people being uptight when they're out there on the field. Doesn't, that doesn't work, but you do have to change the way you think and, and, and view things. And so uh, we just reemphasize that. And I think, you know, let's let me knock on wood and hope that tomorrow we come out and give ourselves a, a chance to win a ball game because obviously the results are what the results are going to be, but it's how we play the game that's that what we're trying to do uh, to give us a chance on a consistent basis over an extended period of time. And for them, the, the experience this on this it's level just, is, is uh, very, very, very important. Yeah. Because I think uh, no one likes, <clears throat> quite frankly, no one likes losing, but no one likes losing the way that game ended up developing. And, and it really did, it just steamrolled, you know, and uh, I think that uh, uh, it, it'd be foolish for us to ignore that it didn't happen. Mm -hmm. And you, you just, you talk about it. Uh, they're, they're, they're bright young men who uh, can take uh, information and, and uh, Put themselves in a position where they're going to try and regroup and, and get back after it tomorrow. But they, ne they need to stay loose, stay focused, and just play the game.